I didn't expect to like My Spollies because I haven't seen The Honeymooners and it is a parody of The Honeymooners and I've seen another Warner Brothers cartoon that parodies The Honeymooners. But honestly, I actually liked it a lot more than I thought. There are definitely things that I didn't find that amusing that I think I would find more interesting if I'd seen The Honeymooners, but there were still bits that I liked. This is a 1960 Warner Brothers cartoon directed by Robert McKimson and written by Ted Pierce. And we have voices provided by Dawes Butler and June Flore. And the characters are mice and it's all about them trying to go out and then returning home and there's a cat. And that's basically the setup. There, there are a little bit more things to it than that. But this cat is basically trying to capture them and is using some clever tactics. And one of the things I love about this is the design of the cat. I love the way the cat's animated. I love the way it looks. I love the way it moves. I think it works very well. I like the way the mice interact with the cat. There's one bit that I thought was brilliantly animated. I won't give away too much, but it involves a match. And what happens after the match is lit. The way that looked visually, I just thought it was really brilliant and really thoroughly enjoyable. The characters were okay. I didn't love them. But again, I don't have reference points. I don't have a source on which to compare them or if they're accurate parodies. So I can't say I loved the cartoon. But I'm aware that, unusually for a Warner Brothers cartoon, I'm not really the target audience. And Warner Brothers don't do that many parodies of specific TV shows. They'll do, you know, certain celebrities or actors and things, um, comedians. But actually a specific TV show, obviously it means that the cartoon is only going to ever be as successful as that TV show remains. As soon as The Honeymooner stops being popular, this stops being that interesting. But it's still got some good bits in it. The cat, as I said, was a delight. The characters I didn't hate, but as I said, I didn't care for them too much. But it's really well animated and a, a pretty decently developed narrative. So I didn't expect to like it at all. But Mice Follies was at least better than expected.